in this video i am going to discuss what is the inict pattern of exam some exam ka ek good pattern hota hai and if you understand the pulse of the exam you are going to crack it very easily at starting let's see the inict marks weightage here i have kept 3 years marks average up to inict november 2024 and what is the marks weightage of inict may 2025 INICT marks weightage is not that much constant as compared to NEET PG, but अगर तुम लोग average को देखोगे तो देखोगे कि लगभग same ही है Like in anatomy, it was average was 13 and this time it was 10. Physio 10, 15, biochem 13, 10. Like this is the marks weightage. Medicine is very much important, 21 questions and this time it came to be 22 questions. So don't neglect medicine. मेडिसिन को शॉर्ट में कंप्लीट करो बट एकदम छोड़ मत देना कि वो तो इंटीग्रेशन है ऑफ पैथोलॉजी फिजियोलॉजी फार्माकोलॉजी एंड ऑल डोंट लीव मेडिसिन फॉर आई एन आई सी टी एटलीस्ट लाइक दिस इट वॉज एज यू कैन सी दैट द मार्क्स वेटेज वॉज मोर और लेस कॉन्स्टेंट इफ यू वॉन्ट द पी डी एफ आई विल सेंड इन माई टेलीग्राम चैनल द लिंक इज गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स बिलो कमिंग टू द क्वेश्चन पैटर्नस एक्सेप्ट the most correct option answer there are other question patterns for inict also like the multiple option correct so i give you an example from the inict may 2025 a 19 year old girl with irregular menses according to rotterdam criteria which of the following are diagnostic of pcos so options are given obesity delayed periods hirsutism insulin resistance rotterdam criteria as you all know consists of signs of hyperandrogenism uhg signs of pcos and menstrual irregularities so you can see sign of hyperandrogenism hirsutism and delayed periods these two are coming in the criteria obesity is not in the criteria insulin resistance is not in the criteria so b and c is the correct option means in the question you have to see which are correct and accordingly you have to choose and the questions are confusing it is time consuming also and the options are confusing true false questions are asked reasoning assertion sometimes they will give you two statement assertion whether it is correct or not and reason whether it is correct or not and if correct it is the correct explanation to the assertion or not sequence type questions came in inict november 2023 many like the karyotyping sequence and all exam pattern it is 50 questions 45 minutes four sets so you get only 54 seconds per each question there is a time crunch it is a pyt based exam now to give an example i am giving you see the image in the aims 2015 it was asked giving the image what is the structure called the answer was simple terian after that which artery passes behind the structure anterior branch of medial meningeal artery after that inict 2022 which bones form this so parietal bone was in the option and it was the answer after that which structure lies behind the terian and the answer was lesser wing of sphenoid after that which structure lies behind terian and inict november it was 2023 the answer was sylvian fissure see 10 questions came from terian itself in the last 10 years so you can understand that from one topic they are giving but the question is not the same all times three times the question came that which structure or which artery lies behind the terian but most of the times they change the question so you have to see a previous year question and then you have to see the direction in which direction they are going they are going what are the structures lying behind terian so you have to search in chat gpt or from the authentic sources that what are the other structures lying behind terian like this you have to study each and every previous year question of past 8 years of inict need pg no need to do and you have to see the direction of the question 
and in that direction you have to prepare the previous year topic direct repeats you will get 10 to 15 questions 10 to 20 questions will be unattemptable like pembrolizumab in non small cell cancer lung it was the keynote trial it was asked that keynote trial is for c the pembrolizumab immune checkpoint inhibitor it is a previous year topic but this time they gave the keynote trial it was given in INICT May 2023. So some questions will be there which are unattemptable. So safe to attempt between 183 to 193. Because if you don't get a top 1000 rank in INICT, you are not going to get a good clinical seat if you are a UR candidate. As I explained that from 2018 onwards, if you do the INICT PYQs, it is sufficient. And if you want to have my INICT PYT topic list of 10 years, then the link is given in the description box below. And there are some specific topics for INICT which they love to ask. And these are not given in notes so much like the monoclonal antibodies, the CDC life cycles and the FDA approved drugs. So these all things you will get for free. The link is given in the description box below. You can check it. Image based question 25 to 30 percent of the questions approximately 50 questions are image based questions only and 100 percent are classical images like this image was given and hamloka time mein INICT may mein tha probably so image half load hua tha one third load hua tha up to this it was loaded. And it was asked that what is the immunofluorescence pattern and it is anti-centromeric pattern or the centromeric pattern. So I searched the image and I found that it was the exact image. Iska khali one third load hua tha. And the canal of petit also. This same image was given in the INICT. So INICT gives classical images. It is very much important that you have a PDF or a digital image bank with all the classical images because in the notes due to copyright issues they can't give all the classical images except the wikipedia ones so they love to ask the images from researchgate wikipedia radiopedia termanet these all sites so i have made a digital image bank of all 19 subjects having 1000 plus images and you can get it at an affordable price it is less than your swiggy dinner also and pre INICT I am giving extra 50 rupees off and this will be your final price so if you want to have it it is given in the description box below and in the pinned comment section so if you found this video useful then do subscribe to my channel and do let me know which topic I should make the next video on all the best for your INICT